actually gonna wait to make this video until um, until I did another one in my sex series, but I promise the next one's coming soon. We have three different ones. I'm not sure which it's gonna be. Um, we're, I'm gonna do a issue on foreplay, one on kink, or probably more specifically um, BDSM, and one on myth versus reality. So you can those look forward to a promise. I haven't abandoned that series. There's more coming up really soon. But this one is a shout out to everyone who watches me outside of the US. In fact, most of the letters I get from people are from outside the US. And I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. And not only that, I wanted to, it, it forces me to address um, America, since that's where I live, um, and a little bit on my, my thoughts on the state of America right now, because I think that the world is watching not only our government but us as citizens to see what we're going to do about different events. And in fact, the reason I originally started making videos was because I wanted to communicate with the international community. And my main thing that I wanted to say to the world was, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for us sticking our nose in everybody's business, even when it's not desired. I'm sorry that America's decided to play God. Um, part of it I understand in the sense that there's some things that with power comes responsibility, such as in World War II, everything that Nazi Germany was doing wasn't necessarily our business, but thank God we eventually got involved. So I'm a little split. What I don't think is right is when we take sides based upon religion and not morality. Um, I am a you know, born and raised Christian, and yet I I respect every other religion so much and respect everyone's right to um, to be a part of that religion and to have freedoms within their religion. Um, while I support America, I don't support the decisions it's made of late and I don't I'm ready to see this next election. I'm ready for some changes to occur. I'm forever hopeful, forever idealistic that that will happen. That we can make those changes for the better. And, and I hope that you as the international community are hopeful for us as well. That you have hope that we won't <laughs> always be the way we've been over the last uh, six, seven years, <laughs> that this administration doesn't represent um, all of us. In fact, it's done a very poor job of representing us. And I hope you guys know that. So, um, without getting too political, because, you know, I everyone's going to, not everyone, I'll get hate messages for this. But, um, that, that was my original purpose of coming on here, so I have to, I have to put that out there. Um, especially now that I get so many messages from you guys, um, outside the U.S. So now that I know you guys, some of you are watching, um, I want to say that. I want to say that 
on behalf of America, I'm sorry for a lot of the things we've done lately. But also, I haven't given up hope, and I hope that the international community hasn't either. So anyway, I'm headed out um, to my friend's 22nd birthday, not party, but hangout. So that's why the pretty dress, well, you can't see it, but yes, prettiness. And uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm going to edit this down so it's not real long, hopefully. Anyway, love you all, and again, I will be back with another installment of my Sex Ed series very soon. Promise. Take care.